We know that there is a solar eclipse Saturday. The moon will cover part of the sun. We know it will be very tempting to <laughs> stare directly at this. Yes, but, but don't, don't don't do it. No. Nope. You could go blind. Health reporter Haley Hernandez is here with more information. Yeah, blinded by the light. That's right. this weekend's theme song. <laughs> Looking directly at a solar eclipse can lead to blind blindness, so you do need to make sure that you have glasses with a specific certification code written inside to know that yours are going to protect you. During the annular eclipse, as explained by meteorologist Anthony Yanez, when the moon is closest to the Earth, but the sun is 400 times farther away, you get a perfect shadow of the moon going between us and the sun. And in our area, the moon will be covering 84% of the sun. So you'll get a good view of its shadow with maximum visibility at 1158 a.m. Saturday. That's tempting to look at. But Dr. Rahul Pundit says do not do it with your bare eyes. You think I think you can because the light is very much dimmed compared to a normal sunlight. Um, uh, it's actually dangerous to your eye and the reason is because when you have the eclipse you're decreasing the amount of light that gets to your eye so your pupil actually dilates and so you're actually getting more of the harmful infrared rays and all that which are not blocked out by the moon. Here's what you need to look for. Eclipse glasses marked ISO with this certification number. It should be labeled appropriately with the guidance where it's made with the standards for the ISO 12312-2 uh, standards for protective wear for eclipses. That's the particular number that was assigned for the certification for lenses that protect you from the light rays that occur during an eclipse. They should appear so dark you can't see anything but the sliver of the sun. This is serious. Even just one time looking at the sun without proper eyewear can make you go blind. So that's why it's of critical importance to really take all precautions when you're enjoying the eclipse to not permanently ruin your vision for the rest of your life. Yeah, and so they are pretty dark. I actually can't see a thing right now, so I'm going to take them <laughs> off. Uh, regular sunglasses are not going to cut it. UV protection helps when you're outside driving, walking around, but staring at the sun can burn the center of your retina, and there's really nothing that's going to fix that. Okay. So you see what I'm saying? When you put them on, it's like pretty dark. You have to stare right at a light to it see is. anything at all. Oh, you're right, and you can barely see these bright lights. Mm -hmm. They're so bright, you can barely yeah. see them. Unless you hook them on your glasses, and then you're not <laughs> actually protected. That makes then don't look at the sun that <laughs> way. No, we can't Make sure you wear these. Rarely I was do wearing I do health reports ones. where I have to tell people not to look at the sun, but this weekend, <laughs> you're going to thank Don't do it. Me. Real right. this time. Get these glasses. Haley, 